Good morning. Welcome to part 2 of our Lisbon adventure. Till now we enjoyed the gorgeous Praça do Comercio with the Tagus River, got lost at atmospheric Alfama, found ourselves in front of the Fado Museum, got lost at Alfama again, and finished our day exploring the St. George Castle and watched the sunset. There is no need to watch part 1 before part 2, we are simply showing different places in the city. Enjoy part 2 now and at the end you will find a link to part 1. Today we will start by exploring Baixa, the historic heart of Lisbon. It stretches from Praça do Comercio to Rossio Square and is surrounded by hilly Alfama and hilly Bairro Alto and Chiado. Let's go to the ground. We are now walking down Rua Augusta a lively pedestrian street in the heart of Baixa. It has many restaurants, shops and bakeries with pasta de nut. It seems that somebody is having a wedding photo shoot in front of one of the landmarks of Lisbon. The Santa Gesta lift was built in 1902 by an apprentice of Gustav Eiffel and similar to the vintage trams which roam Lisbon is a popular tourist attraction. Next on the list are two beautiful squares and a church. And that's the open sky ruins of Convento do Carmo, which we will visit later today. Have you noticed that so many buildings are entirely decorated with tiles? Let's take a break and jump to the National Tile Museum, which explains the origins and evolution of this art in Portugal. Before continuing, let's go down to a metro station and purchase and top on a Viva Viagem card. It will save us money when using the metro, buses, trams, funiculars and even the Santa Just a Lift, which is also a form of public transportation. Next to Figueira Square is the Church of Saint Dominic. It's a miracle that this church, dating from 1241, survived the earthquake. One popular way to enjoy Lisbon is by hopping on tram 28 and enjoying 45 minutes of the scenic ride. The wine is moving very slowly because everyone wants a seat. We calculated that it will take us 3 hours to get in. <laughs> a smart thing to do is to come early, possibly before 9. We are ready for the ride and to take some pictures. We are now heading to Bairro Alto, but instead of climbing, we will use a fancier way to get on top. Thank you. 
I got distracted by the gypsy and the dog. Where did Petya go? She is probably looking for something to buy. Nope, she is enjoying the view. We need a power boost before visiting Convento do Carmo, the monastery which lost its roof during the 755 earthquake and because of that it's a popular tourist attraction nowadays. Let's now cross Chiado and go to another viewpoint. It offers a great view of the river. <laughs> now I hope we all agree we deserve a dinner at the best possible place. In 2014, Time Out magazine gathered all the top restaurants in Lisbon under one roof, the roof of Mercado de Ribeiro. Three Michelin stars chefs own restaurants here. After some careful deliberation, we picked. <laughs> now we are waiting patiently for this thing to start flushing. Do I need to say anything, except that it has a few different kinds of meat inside? Well, we will need part 3 for the marvelous Belen. At the time you are watching this video, it will be probably on. The link to it and part 1 will be in the description. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one. Please consider subscribing to our channel if you like to watch travel videos from around the world.